past time, but um, yeah, we shall we shall see. So yes, I don't know why my GPU is going mad. It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be the settings I've got. Uh, but let me know. Let me know what things look like at the other end whilst things are moving around and stuff. Hi, Halloween. Nice to see you. You don't trust Chrome? Chrome, Chrome? Chrome does eat resources up quite a bit. Right, okay. So, uh, we were at the Tufo Monster estate and quest, and we can't go down there because it is somewhat too high a level for me at the moment. That I do recall. I do recall having to run away from that. We could go over to my vineyard. Uh, there's some stuff to do over there. I think... What level was this one? I just switch quests a minute. So, okay, we might go over to the quarry foreman over here, in which case we'll take this... Which way should we go? Yeah, let, let's just go straight for it. It's not far. Right. Get on my trusty steed. Come on, Roach, where are you? Game's all, it all looks like it's moving smoothly and working at my end. That's behaving itself. You're looking forward for the Mark Makes Cheese tonight, E-Dammer? Come on, Roach. <laughs> cheese making streams, I'm sure that's the future of Twitch. Yeah, I am not so convinced that 2PC streaming is the future of Twitch or anything else. It's... There's so many little links in the chain. So many little things you have to set up to get the getting the picture over is the easy part. Go, go. Uh, and getting the audio over isn't too bad. It's getting things like Twitch alerts coming back to you. It's setting up microphones so you can use Discord and stuff, and sending Master. audio back and forth. And there's so many. Whoa, steady, Roach. There's so many little links in the chain that if one tiny thing goes wrong, it Move nobbles the whole lot. So. Yeah, if, if I had the money, I would just build a mega computer that have no worries about streaming and recording and recording two different uh, lots of video on one mach machine Faster. all at the same time. That would be the way forward. Check the capture card settings. Who knows, it might be causing the extra GPU usage by doing something like pushing double frames. Uh, no, because the problem is on gaming end the capture card is on the streaming end so where all the usage is coming from it's it's from this and that's set to only 60 hertz so it's it's nothing that that's not where the usage comes in it's 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 quite odd and bizarre um anyway I, i'm going to keep looking over there because I, I don't trust things to have worked fully uh anyway let's see where we need to go Dual PC stream is a thing of the past because of the 16 core CPUs by Ryzen. Multitask all you want. Well, you would think, but there are other reasons for um, a dual PC stream. And one is to record two lots of video footage. One is the stream footage, which I upload to my second channel as a Let's Play series. And the other is just raw gameplay footage, which doesn't matter for The Witcher tonight. But if I was streaming other stuff, other games that I'd want to keep the raw footage for use in reviews and other stuff, um, that's, that's the way to do it. And then you use the the, uh, the GPU and the hardware encoder to record whatever you're doing, and the CPU to encode at different settings to, to go up and stream. So it's not all quite so straightforward. What they call it, blasting devils? Are you doing, man? What oh, plague? That An unfortunate turn of offense, that's all. Get back to chiseling. If we don't deliver that hat on time, the infestor will twist my plums off. <laughs> that sounds that sounds pretty painful. Is that what you'll tell Emil's widow? That a cow crushed him and it was an accident? This, sir, uh, is a grave matter. It requires a specialist, some mage or warlock. Or a witcher. What happened here? Look, it's that witcher who's come to town. Maybe he can do something, an exorcism or the like. We should ask how much coin he'll want. Saw your notice. Got a problem with a cow? Fear a plague, is that it? A yes, plague? indeed, and a horrid one at that. We've earned the gods something true we have. In Zeracania, they've sent a plague of locusts, then of frogs. With us, they skipped right to raining cows <laughs> down on us. That's pretty brutal. Enough. Enough! No need to so panic! Come, Master Witcher, I shall divulge to you the matter at hand. Yes, the juicy details. No raining cows, I hope. 
Yes, an unfortunate matter indeed, to be crushed by a cow. A true shame, Emil. He was a good worker. I told them at once there had to be a simple explanation. But that lot, no. Right away they started in screaming, PLAGUE! Demanding higher wages for hardship. Poor working conditions, you see? They ruin me, the blotters. Mm. My job is to figure out why a cow fell from the sky. That it? That too. The thing is, since none <laughs> bother to clear the cow corpse, some filths overrun the other pit. We fear to venture there. The cow falling from the cat sky, I can explain, Not surprised. I cow, where did it come from? What kind was it? Why, the ordinary spotted kind. Nothing unusual. Its corpse rots in the other pit, sends out its stench. I love this accent. And the meal lies right beneath it. Will you tend to the matter and take on the contract? Of course. But we need to talk about my pay. Hang on, where's, where's the bit about where I talk about my pay? Hmm, it's missing. Yeah, cow falling from the sky. That's got to be something like a griffin picking up a cow and flying off with it and dropping it by accident. I suspect. What exactly is going on here? Construction of a statue of the prophet Lepiota. We're carving it. Not all at once, that is, but piece by piece. A pious infestus revived the project after years of neglect. He's engaged all nearby quarries in its completion. And we would be on schedule were it not for the incident. Please, master. Will you look into it? I like it the way he says, uh, please, master. Oh, Meteor, sorry, I, I missed your message. Uh, you just finished your 100% playthrough, including the DLCs, and ended up at 170 hours. How many hours are you in? I think... I'll have a look when you get past this conversation. I think I must be about 135, 140, maybe 100, maybe over 140 now. Yeah, it's it's good. And the, the great thing is, I feel like I just want to go through and play it all again for all the different stuff. Um, you get so many hours out of this game. It's quality. Night Night Ragnus anyway. Nice to see you. Thanks for dropping by. Need to know more about this accident. Anyone actually see what happened? No. But sounds there were. Osterv had just gone to see how Emil was getting along when <coughs> suddenly we heard an ear botching boom. Moments later, something smashed into one of the cranes. An ear botching boom. it was the boom. cow that hit the crane. Probably true. At any rate, come morn, we ventured out to sea, but the vermin drove us off. With that, all work came to a halt. Has remained so since. Master, tarry no longer, please. Will you take on the matter? Ah, this is where we get to talking to about talk money. About my reward before I decide. Ah, time for a good heckle. So, how much would you take? I'm going to ask a lot because I've been, I've been under asking in a lot of these conversations, and they've just agreed to it. So, I'm going to try high. Hmm. You must go lower for it to make any sense to me. Hmm, that was a bit too much because the last few I've asked, it's just I've been. Wow. Must go lower for it to make any sense to me. Okay, I'm just upsetting this guy now. We're getting nowhere. Fine. But that is the sum total. No bonuses hmm. or gratuities on top. Understood. It's quite hard work actually agreeing a price in this game. Fine, I'll look into it. Might be a botched portal, but I doubt it. Lapiota reward you with progeny plenty. I shall keep an eye out for your return. Okay, so, the ear-splitting boom, um, that's thrown my theory of the griffin out the window. Maybe it is a, a botched portal, where a mage has tried to open a portal and send a cow through when it's gone wrong. I, I don't know. Oh. Take that, thank you very much. Oh no, I thought the dog was dead. Dog alright? Can you pet the dog? You can't pet the dog in this game, can you? Ah, oh, that's a shame. Oh, sorry, I was going to have a look at how long I'd played this for, wasn't I? Um, it is on player stats. I'm probably hiding it. 144 hours and 42 minutes. Uh, I've had some quality time out of this game. By the way, folks, what about volume levels? Can you hear me all right on the mic? Can you hear the game all right in the background? I've had to slightly readjust everything with getting all the settings over onto the second PC. So let me know if there's any issues. Examine the cow carcass and the workman's body. Where are we going with this? 
we going? We're not going up there. Okay. Drink. Give yes, we me are. A drink. I feel like I've been here before. This looks familiar. I don't think I. No, I haven't. I obviously haven't been to Tucson before. But there's another quarry zone, isn't there? With some bad guys in in one area. I can't remember where it was. Oh, hang on, hang on. The hell, harpies. Okay, well, like that kind of explains. What the hell is that? Okay, they're not harpies at all. The screams I heard <laughs> were from something else. What have we got? We've got algools. Let me just remember we want um, necrophage oil. Which we haven't used for a while. And we want for these things, uh, it is Axie. Muck up the tracks. Axie or Ard, I can't remember. Let's try Axie. Oh well. That worked. Come on, let's do a little bit of whirl. Ouch. Two of them down, one left. Uh, how's my regeneration? It's going back up, that's good. Very nice glowing sword there. Get all the guts and bits and bobs. And dang, thank you very much for the cheer. 500 bits, man, that's that's really generous, thanks. So we know that bit's working. <laughs> I guess the stream alert goes off on the other PC and I've had to route it through some audio to get through here. That, that, was, that took a bit of setting up and a lot of bad language. But thanks for the bits, that's that's really cool, thanks. Sounds good, is it? All sounds okay? How am I doing today? I'm doing fine, thank you very much. Uh, I'm a little bit nervous because two PC streaming setup and uh, it, it, it started, it was been working fine all weekend and it just started glitching just a little bit on something which I'm hoping I've, I've sorted out, but uh, you guys are gonna have to let me know as soon as anything anything plays up. Must be a meal. Workers mentioned him. Poor guy, unlucky as all hell. Right, now where do I start? Okay, we're doing a full autopsy on this mess. Punctures and slashes on the cow. Deep claw wounds. Spread between talons indicates a trachinid. A wyvern okay. probably. But these wounds weren't the cause of death. Curious. I was about to say, maybe my theory was correct. Got sliced open. Hmm. Not much blood, so it happened after death. Heart had already stopped pumping. Two marks. Small ones, though. So necrophages left them clearly. Sure sniffed out their feast fast. Okay, so that, that was the ghouls, I think. You also changed your Witcher build a bit. You added toxicity tolerance, went from 100 to 266. Also, the sign intensity is 230%. That's just... Um, that's like sorcerer level, surely. Tissues crushed in places. Must have fallen from quite a height. Crushed by something heavy. Skull base is cracked. I wonder Fresh what. tooth marks. Necrophages. But they got to him after his death. Won't learn anything else from the body. Well, that was no great eye opener, was it? Got it. All clear now. Cow died when it <laughs> fell from a great height. Drachonid must have dropped it. Okay. A youngster probably trying to get the cow back to its nest, but it proved too heavy. Emil's bad luck to be standing right underneath. So I was right, but what about this earth-shattering boom? And then there's the crane. All right, maybe we're going to find out about this earth-shattering boom. But first, I'm just going to go and check this before I forget. Is it just trash? Ah, okay. I was hoping there might be a load of... I got some undiscovered locations, which is nice, but I thought there might have been a, a load of um, quests on there. So is it this thing? Where the hell am I going? Wait. How do I... I have to go up. So, oh, I see, I see, I see, right. 
Uh, let's see, can I add that rubbish away? Not with Axie, I can't. Ooh, that's got it. Right, let's go around. Let's see. Put that away. There we go. What is that? I knew there'd be something on there. Did the did the Draconid fly into blood? This Draconid must have hit it pretty hard. <laughs> Dropped the cow, then probably tried to steady its flight. Got hurt in the process. Good. Should be simple to track down. Okay. That makes more sense now. That makes more sense about the boom and the bang. Using three decoctions at a time is pretty... I bet it is. Traces of draconid blood. Barely perceptible. I'm on the right track. I mean, what does that do to your... To, to Geralt's face, though? Because I know, like, um... When... Is it the same that, you know, when you get towards the top of your tolerance level, you, uh... You look like you've, I don't know, put in on drugs and have got black streaks and everything. But does it look worse because your tolerance level is so much higher? Or does it just look like the same as mine would be when I reach the, the max of it? It's working. Whoop, no, that's working. That's fine. All's good. All's good on the other end. Is that just taking me straight back? I missed a vital clue somewhere. Yes, I thought so. Back on the trail. Nose like a blood hound, that lad. And about as much common heavily. sense. Wound was more serious than I thought, looks like. <laughs> so, it flew into the crane. I mean, that must be, be like a seriously big it because normally I mean I don't do that much damage to a bloody wyvern or anything when I hit it can't find anything to oh I, I see I see let's go this way up because it looks cool oh, oh. Hmm. smells like sour mash smells like death <laughs> he's coming in He's coming in hot. The toxicity glitch is out for you. Most of the times it looks like normal Geralt. Once you get haircut, you look like the one Geralt you posted in the video on Discord. Yeah, that that looked um, that looked a little bit extreme, did that? And Still dodge, bastard. We need Igni. Igni didn't do anything. Come on, swing that sword. <laughs> they, weren't, they weren't close enough. I'm just getting a little bit chopped up here. <laughs> now, now go to work, Gerald. Do it, do it. Whoa, 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 whoa. I forgot, no. I forgot those things blow up. How far back has that put me? Uh, the bane of my Witcher existence is things that blow up when you kill them. In fact, I think I can apply that to any game. Oh, all the way back here. Fantastic. Okay. Well, that was that was totally my fault. Right. Come on then. Where's the way up? At least we know where we're going this time. There's a quest on this map that will not show up until you're close by. It's not one to miss. I try and remember to tell you where to go for if you don't find it by the time you're near the end, as it's easy to miss. Cheers, okay. Yeah, so if I, if I don't find it normally in my playthrough, then then let me know. Cheers. Right, so we go and get the... Oh. That would have been so much easier if I'd done that the first time. Blood. Dragon, it must have hit it pretty hard. Dropped the cow, then probably tried to steady its flight. Got hurt in the process. Good. Should be simple to track down. Let's go. Traces of draconid blood. Barely perceptible. Barely on perceptible. The track. There's a lot of draconid blood.
started bleeding heavily. Wound was more serious than I thought, looks like. The Draconid probably got killed by one of those exploding rot fiends. That's my theory. Makes perfect sense now. We'll get Igneon. And we're going to have my Necrophage Oil. Sour mash. Dragon it must have attacked the instantly. Bastard. Did he just hit me? How dare you, sir? <laughs> Hang on, he's gonna start he's gonna he's gonna pop. I'm wise to that this time. <laughs> Ouch. Can I... Right, one's going to pop at that, I think. I think. Whoa, no, 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 not him, not him, not him. Hmm, I don't think this game was designed for fighting on multiple levels. Get him, get him, Geralt. Get some revenge on the scumbag. Whoa, 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 right. Do you see? Do you see how fast I learn? My lightning fla flast? Lightning flast reflexes. Yes, flast is a word. It's a new word. We're going to add it to the uh, Yorkshire English Dictionary. Super flast. Take those potatoes. Take everything. Everything. Quite a nice little stash of stuff here, actually. Bootlegger's notes. So I say to that, Minister Tremblay, the whole Sanstrator Valley is overrated. Those wines, why? Don't get me started on Est Est. Ever since they started mass producing it, they should call it Ete Ete, for it's definitely seen better days. And he says, right you are, always being a Cote de Blesseur chap myself. In fact, between you and me, I even prefer it to Sangriol. You know, the wine reserved for illustrious highness in their inner circle. This is all very interesting stuff, I'm sure. And then, the fool I am, I blurt out, Oh, I agree, whenever a grace has me to taste it, I've got to swill my mouth out with vodka afterwards to wash out the rancid taste. Oh, come on. I was drunk, wasn't I? Talking out of my bum. Well, turns out I had rather overvalued my position at court. Tremblay needed but say a word in the Duchess's ear, and in three shakes of a donkey's tail, I was out on the street. The job of ducal tasters being given back to Benoit. Can you believe it? After that scandal involving Baroness Neek and Quilleen? Baronesses Neek and Quilleen. Wow, that's, that's going to be a story. That's a side quest I want to be part of. As for me, well, what was I supposed to do? I had no choice but to start making and drinking my own brews. That's always been my true passion. This is a winemaker's note. You're talking about that quest? You think it's on one of the notice boards? I'll try and be sure to pick all those up then. Wait, we've still got some clues here. Landed on the roof of the distillery, raised a ruckus, made a mess, and moved on. All right, I'll take your word for it. Paw prince, crawled through here, clearly too tired to fly. Wait, well, can't be much further now then. What I want is a nice juicy corpse at the end of this. Was in a bad way, barely crawling. This thing's done some serious damage to itself just from hitting a crane. Mm, second draconid landed ah. here, a larger one. Waited for the smaller one to heal, then they flew off together. Should be easy to track. Smaller one was still bleeding, luckily. Okay, that changes things a little bit. hell is that? Oh, I thought that was a monstrous footprint. Flew off together. Probably bound for their nest. Yeah, two angry draconids defending a nest. That's like... Okay, we've got a... There's no clues on it, but it's clearly a dead cow. Oh, hello. Trail ends here. Nest's up there. I bet the farm on it. Yep, well, there, there we go. 
There's the culprit. Uh, I think we're going to quick save, and I think we want ourselves some draconid oil on there. Uh, where are we? What even does draconid oil look like? There we go. I might just I might just play this safe on Quen as well. Hey, Mr. Fester, thank you very much for the uh, two months of Prime subscriptions. Go get those cows, those cow killers. We'll get them. We'll bring justice to those innocent cows. Geralt of Rivia, defender of bovines. This is looking like a pretty interesting little area up here, actually. Right, let's go and get this fella out of the sky. Hang on, we need to... Chop, 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 chop. That, that thing's... Okay, that thing's looking dangerous. This thing actually breathing fire. Holy crap. Slizzards? Is that what these things are called? Slizzards? Never heard of them. Can I shoot him with a crossbow? Doesn't drop him. Son seems to be joining a <laughs> One at a time, ladies and gentlemen, please. Ow! <laughs> Holy crap! Right. Oh, well, there goes my Quen. Let's make sure that Quen is back on, shall we? Oh well, we've got one down. Go to work, God, Geralt. This is your bread and butter stuff here. And then move because there's a <laughs> flame incoming. I'm supposed to be the one wielding the fire, not you guys. Is that dead? That's dead now, right? Cool. How's my Quen doing? It's good. Right, we've got a better handle on these things now, I think. Come on. Come on. Shoot him. <laughs> That's... Oh, no, no, no. No, don't you dare. I thought he was going to fly off. That's an impressive damn monster. <laughs> that was not the way to uh, stand and take a hit there. <laughs> but we got him. We got him. Right. High time I collected a trophy. Rest of Plenty of red mutagens yet. here. Need to burn the whole nest. Yes, I must set fire to this nest as well. Don't let me forget. If I decide to look for Manticore armor diagrams, you should get to that quest naturally. Cool. I do intend doing all the armor stuff. I'm not necessarily making it all because that's expensive. And uh, I am lacking funds. But I will gather all the patterns. We'll get that nest in a moment as well. Those are nice looking eggs. Look at that, it looks like some giant quail's eggs. That'll do it. Collect a reward for solving or solving the cow mystery. False teeth. I guess if I stay in the adventuring game long enough, I'm likely to need some. Where's the oh it's down below. I've got to go in the entrance down below. Okay. Anything else to search for around here? Because this must be that ruined Fort Lafog mentioned. Worth a look. I suspect there's another quest around here, actually. Let's just get the map on a second. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. That's got to be foxgloves, no? Wolfsbane? I don't remember any others looking like that. 